President Trump, stay out of the Democratic primary. Why don't you do your job for a change as president? Stop lying. Stop running a corrupt administration. Pay attention to the American people, not just your own uh, political aims. I think there's no question the establishment, the Democrat establishment, is trying to take it away from Bernie Sanders. There's no question about that in my mind. I would have said two, three days ago, Biden was not looking too good. Now he's looking better. Whoever it is, I don't care. I really don't care. Whoever it is, we will take him on. Folks just like to pretend that we were asking them to believe in Santa Claus um, as if we were just completely delusional uh, when we've said over and over that the system was rigged. These were things that we were actually seeing out in the field that we knew to be true. I move that all votes, all votes cast by delegates be reflected in the official record. And I move that Hillary Clinton be selected as the nominee of the Democratic Party for president of the United States. Clinton says in Congress, nobody likes Sanders. She dismisses him as a career politician and adds, it's all just baloney. And I feel so bad that people got sucked into it. And you call it, quote, just baloney. And I feel so bad that people got sucked into it. Do you still feel that way now? Sure. Yeah. I mean, you know, that that was my authentic opinion then. It's my authentic opinion now. For people to use Russian talking points to sow division among Americans, that is stupid. So, Rana, go to hell. This oh, is wow. not about, no, go to hell. I'm tired of it, Ed. We're not trying to prevent anyone from becoming the nominee. If you have the delegates and win, you will win. This notion that somehow or another Democrats are out there trying to put hurdles or roadblocks before one candidate, that's stupid. The public doesn't really desire the nominee. The public gets to vote for president of the United States, but people who are active in the party, who participate in the party, they decide the nominee. And just because you're a pledged delegate for Bernie Sanders or a pledged delegate for Joe Biden doesn't mean when you get to the convention floor that you'll stay a delegate for Biden or Sanders. 93 Democratic Party officials are willing to have a brokered convention if Sanders does not receive the majority of delegates by convention time. They're also willing to risk damaging the party to stop his nomination. The Times notes that such a situation may result in a brokered convention, a messy political battle, the likes of which Democrats have not seen since 1952, um, when the nominee was Adlai Stevenson. I can't even imagine the rebellion among his supporters if he doesn't get the nomination. There would be, but his supporters helped write those rules. The way I see this is you write the rules before you know where everybody stands. And then you stick with those rules. Everybody got in the race thinking that was the set of rules. I don't see how come you get to change it just because he now thinks there's an advantage to him for doing that.